Hey everybody, today I'm doing a short story on how I took out my tragus piercing, which I did today. So as you can see, it's got like a really bad keloid on it. And I usually get keloids on it, well on piercings, but they usually go away. But this one didn't and I had it for like six months. Because like these ones, my conch and flat, those got keloids too, but they went away around like, around the six month mark. And as you can tell, they're gone <laughs> and this one didn't and like you can tell like it's if you can see it's it's it used to look worse it used to look a lot worse like pus and like red it was red and stuff like that and like there's like a lot of extra skin like sometimes you'd be like a scab and stuff like that that I'd actually like peel off of it which is why it looks a little smaller now but Yesterday I took off the extra skin and it was literally bigger than bigger than the ball of the piercing itself. So yesterday I made this, not yesterday, but the day before, made this decision just to take it out because it was just a whole big deal and stuff like that. Sorry, sticky notes <laughs> and other shit. But one of the confusing things was I made the appointment today at 10.30, but not 10.30, 12.30. But when I went there... He's like, oh, come back in an hour because I'm working on a, a tattoo or something like that. So I'm like, um, alright. So I came, went back in, in an hour and then he's like, oh, you need to come back in like 15 minutes because I'm still working on somebody. I'm like, oh, okay, well. Which is kind of weird because I made the appointment like days before this happened. And so, I don't know, just kind of annoying because <laughs> like it's really just like taking it out. And when it did happen, it literally was like seconds but I guess, I don't know, I don't know how some piercing places are, but that one, it was just like, I don't know, I wouldn't want to be, like, I literally waited like an hour and a half to get it taken out. But I guess it's so well. <laughs> it's taken out now. It was a big problem. Sorry, I heard like a click and it scared me. Um, but yeah, I'm back and it didn't hurt to take it out. It was just, hopefully that goes away. It usually does, because when I got my nipple pierced, it had a keloid, but... And there was, it was a whole, that one's a difficult situation. I had to take that one out too. I'm debating on getting like a, the helix, so that one's that right, right there. Because the reason why I got like a cure is because I, I put in like, like earbuds sooner than I should have. So that was a big mistake. So that's why I was like, I should probably get one right here. Because then I always got like an airport, not airport, an airplane like pillow just to sleep on. Like how like, you watch Lulu's body piercing, how they say, like, do that. So I'm like, I should probably do that. <sighs> I'm, I've am i been a, f a weird day. Well, like, a stressful day, as I guess. I don't know. What else did I do today? I put in another application to get a second job because the first one isn't doing much for me. I still love it. I love it so much, and I never want to quit there because I love the people that work there. And the boss is chill, and I love it. I just need another one so I can, like, get out of the house. You know what I mean? <laughs> just, like, I need to move on. Because everybody else my age, so I'm doing, like, that. <laughs> everybody else my age is, like, you know, married and out. So I'm, like, I need to start doing something. Like, like do stuff for me instead of, like, I don't know. Sorry, this is not a, <laughs> a rant video about my, my life. But it's just a little update on, like... This thingy, sorry, acne, the worst acne all over. I don't know, I don't know what to do. I think it's from stress, because I've been very stressed this week, so it's been bad, as you can see. A lot of acne, but I don't care anymore. <laughs> I lost, I lost, all my ducks went out the window. So, sorry, if you hear hopping sound, it's my guinea pig. I don't know if I can, he's like right here. There he is! Yeah, I changed his location in my room because the other side was a little too cold. It was by the window. It was a little too cold, so I was like, I should just move him right there. <sighs> and it's nice. I'm thinking about getting another guinea pig, but I'll have to wait for an, a, another job also so I can pay the vet bills since I still need to take him back because he's been. So I'm looking at him. I'm distracted by my son, but he's been sneezing and stuff like that. And I think it's because, it's not the bedding, because I tried that 
Well, maybe he is. I don't know. But, well, no, because I, sorry, but he's, I've caught him, like, eating his own, like, shit and whatever. So now I've just been, like, extra picking out, even if you, like, just barely pooped, I just, like, pick it up and, like, nope. So would I put new bedding in there and stuff like that. I clean his cage very daily, like, every other day and stuff like that. I, like, clean it out. So it's extra. Now I do it. Extra, like, extra picking it up. So that it's all good and shit. So hopefully that stopped. Like it's, he stopped sneezing so far, like lesser. So I'm hoping that helps. Sorry, I am not. I'm just ranting off. Oh, I'm. Just, I don't know what else to talk about. So I'm a go. Sorry if this video is boring as fuck and not interesting at all. So I'd like to update you. And just in case if I do other videos and you see like, oh, where'd that go? It's just. Yeah, that's just there. <laughs> Anyways, bye.